Hi YouTube, I'm going to get right into it. This is my drugstore uh, haul makeup wise. So I'm going to go and I think it was from Walmart, Sears, and I did order stuff online from Milani. And this is the first thing I'm going to get. It's said a fill moisturizer. I was running out, so I thought I'd buy a new one. Now, I bought a lot of lip products, so I'm going to get that out of the way. And I'm going to start with these infallible um, lip colors. Okay, and there are three that I got. So this is the first one and it is in Mulberry. Okay, I'm gonna try to do swatches. I'm sure you guys have heard of this. It's a plum purple. Um, you just put the lip stain on and then you get the white portion out and uh, you just put it on after it dries to give it the shine and to seal the color in. I never really bought these before just because I didn't like that you couldn't swatch any of the colors, but um, I really want to get the Beyonce one. This is actually Linda Evangelista's color in Linda's Beige. Let me just swatch that for you quickly. There you go. It's a really nice neutral. It's a bit darker than I thought it would be, so I was kind of disappointed, but um, regardless, I did wear it, and it still ended up fine. And this is what I'm actually wearing right now, which is Beyonce's Red. Well, I won't swatch it. It's on my lips. Okay. <laughs> Now, I got a couple things because they were on sale and Shoppers Drug Mart was also having the 20 times the points. So, I don't know where I got these. They're either from Walmart or uh, Shoppers Drug Mart. The first one is the Maybelline Color Sensational and it is in Fuchsia Fever. Uh, I mean, like, look at how pretty that color is. So, I guess I'll start swatching on my arm. <laughs> Let me just watch and that's the color doesn't do it justice it's so pretty okay and I also got um, coral crush which looks like this and it looks really red right now I don't know my lighting is doing something really weird to it but it's a lot more on the like I don't know how to explain it. it's not even I guess orange tone I don't know the lighting is making it look weirder than it actually is I don't know if that makes it better and I got Pink Peony, which looks like this, and it's just really pretty. It actually reminds me of that Lancome color, actually. One of them. And it has more of a shimmer to it. And last but not least is On the Mauve. And it's a lot darker. I actually really love it, though. And it's more on the purpley plum side, which I am loving. There we go. Okay, so I also got a lot of colors from Ramel. I'm going to start with their, um, what's it called? Moisture Renew Lipsticks. Okay, and I got three. This one is in Vintage Pink, which I had my eye on for such a long time. And it's like a plum, like, it's like another purple, purpley plum. But it has like a pink undertone to it. There we go. And I also got Sweetheart Tulips, which I thought was such a cute... Like, they have a tulip one, but this one I love so much better on the swatches. And it's right there. So pretty. And last one I got was Flirtatious. I thought this was so pretty. I know it looks really dark, um, but on the lip, it's so much better. Like, it has more of a reddish, plummy undertone. That's how it looks like right here. So, I just thought that was so pretty. <laughs> and I also got a bunch of these, um, I don't know what they call it, Rimmel London uh, Lasting Finish Lips. Now, I got, I was kind of upset because I did end up getting two the same. I didn't realize. So this one is in Vogue, and it looks like this. It looks like a red. I don't know why the lighting is doing that. I don't even know how to show you guys. But it's not. It's really like a really pigmented magenta pink. And it's so pigmented. It goes on really creamy. This is Paradise, which is more of like a chestnut beige 
color, but it's good for a neutral lip. But it's more within the season because it's a bit darker than a usual neutral. This is Nostalgia. It's so pretty. I think these are one of the colors that I got twice. And it's a nice pink. Like, I never noticed it before. But it's a nice pale pink. More for summer. And I also got Jet Set Red. And I just loved the red. Like, I realized I didn't have that many red lipsticks. So I figured I might as well. It's right there. So it's a little lighter than that color. And I also got True Vintage, which was so pretty too. I mean, it looks like a dark brown, something I never thought I would get. But when you put it on, it's more of a mauve um, a dark mauve color. It's so pretty right there. And last but not least <laughs> is the Heavenly, which is so pretty. It's like a, it's a mix between purple and pink, and it has a bit of, like, a blue undertone to it. And it's going to go right here. As you can see, like, that's so pretty. So I went lipstick crazy. Now, I also got this. It's from Nicole, and it's by OPI. It's a Kardashian color, and I think the one I chose was Rainbow in the Skyly, S. Kylie, and it just, look at that. Like, I don't know. Out of all the nail polishes, this is the only one that attracted my eye because it's so different the other sparkly nail polish that I have. So I went ahead and I bought that. From Milani's, I got two things. I finally got another Milani Easy Brow Automatic Pencil that's water resistant. I know I've talked about this before. It's automatic. You put it on. It's my favorite color in natural taupe. And then you just brush it off. It comes with a brush. So I started using this already. And this eyeshadow here in Illusion, which I really wanted for the longest time to, uh, oh my gosh, I can't even open it, to do oh, a certain look. And it really is an Illusion. I thought, like, when I saw it, I'm like, oh my gosh, it's pink. But when you swatch it, I don't even know if you'll see that, like, it's pink, but it's more of a golden color with pink undertones in it. So it's really pretty. I love that. Okay, now I have to hurry up. This is the Physician's Formula um, blush. I know you guys have probably seen that before. Uh, I got it from Shoppers Drug Mart, but they were having a sale. This on its own, usually Canadian, is $17.99. Um, but I got this and this, which came with a bronzer. It was a bonus. For $20.99 and I figured that is such a good deal I couldn't pass it and with the 20 times the points why not you're gonna hear me say that a lot so I'm sorry if you guys are getting annoyed but I loved I jumped at the chance there were like two more and I wanted to get it but I figured I don't need to um, there's a pink one here and a bronzer here so it was really cute. I don't have these, though I did look for them before. So I'm e eager to try them out. And the last thing is I got were um, these four different palettes, and they were from Shoppers Drug Mart. I was eyeing them. Originally, they were $15, and they went on sale for $4.99. So this is the Beijing. I don't know. They don't have a name really on them. So I'm just going to open it for you guys. And what's attracted me was just the product. I've never heard of this line before. So if you guys have heard about this, please let me know. There's a mirror. And it's a beigey pink blush. And these fun colors. Like, look how much product you get with that. Yeah. And they're fairly pigmented. I'll do swatches for you another time if you guys really want. That's another blush. And this is the green box one. And there you go. This is the blue, purplish blue. I've already used this somewhat. And the blush is a bit darker. And the colors oh, are so pretty. I mean, look at that. Sorry, I was swatching earlier. So if you guys really do want to see swatches, please let me know. And the last but not least, sorry, is this dark purple one with a bright pink blush. And bright colors. So thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in my next haul. <laughs> Bye.